Well, this day is full of surprises. Go, and stay safe. Him. A samurai. We have no food for you, my lord. I wouldn't accept any if you did. Not after what the Eagle Tribe did to your camp. Was anyone hurt? We were spared thanks to Doshun, the monk who oversaw this camp. He agreed to go with the Mongols peacefully if they didn't harm us. Where did they take him? We don't know, but we have people searching. I'll help. It's a rare man who would sacrifice himself for others. Hotoke can tell you where our men are searching. Her husband is leading the group. The men searching for Doshin. Did you see where they went? No, and I'm not waiting around for them either. The monk risked his life so you could stay. I didn't ask him to, and now he's gone. There's no more food or supplies. It does me no good to stay. I can't believe it. It's been 15 years since I saw a samurai. You must mean Lord Sakai's men. Yes, from the invasion. There's nothing here for you to take. The Mongols have it all. I'm here to help find the monk, Doshin. You are? My husband and a few others are looking for him. They followed the Mongols toward the bridge. I'll show you. You should stay. It could be dangerous. I want to help. I owe Doshin more than most. This way. What I said earlier about the samurai? I'm sorry. The invasion took so much from me. You mean your arm? You must have been a child. War or no, that shouldn't have happened. I found a wounded samurai in our stable. Gave him food and water. My father caught me. Cut off my arm. The hand that fed the enemy, he said. That's cruel. He was wrong. No. He was right. The next night, the samurai came to our village and slaughtered everyone. It was Doshun who took me in, tended my wound. I survived because of him. I owe him my life. There's something on the path. Men have been cut down. My husband! Stay there. I'll check. I think I might be sick. Focus on breathing. This man is older. Lokoro. He left with my husband. He was new to camp.
He's younger. There's a mark on his chin. <sighs> That's Kanaji. He had a wife and children. Do you think my husband got away? We need to find the Mongols, quickly. This rice... It must have come from your camp. Likely. The Mongols took all our food. Let's follow it. What would Hotoke say if she knew who you are? Mutilated. Her village slaughtered. All to feed your father's arrogance. You didn't answer my question. About my husband. Do you think he got away? We should go as fast as we can. I'm trying. But my feet and back... I had to come. I owe Doshun everything. But if I lose my husband... I don't know what I'll do. We'll find him. I never thought I'd have a family. But then I met Togo. With him, so many things became possible. But without him... Stay here until I kill the Mongols. on the beach. I need a better look. Togo! Is he hurt? I can't tell. But the Mongols will kill him if they know we're here. A monk. Potion. They have him bound. Ready for execution. No. You can't save both. Sacrifice her husband and she falls into despair. Let the monk die and her hopes die with him. Please, you have to save them. I won't be able to save both. The moment I make a move, the Mongols will see me. When that happens... I can't lose either of them. I'll do what I can. I owe you my life. My lord, the young man, does he live? I couldn't reach him in time. Forgive yourself. He deserves hell, not forgiveness. Hotoki. You've robbed my child of a father. If I had known... Our lives had no value to you. That was true 15 years ago, and you proved the same today. It was an impossible choice. My husband would not die in vain. She will forgive you in time. 
Make sure you forgive yourself. The Mongols will pay for the agony you endured. Something's so over. Ah! No! The ghost! I'm sorry. Ugh! 